This is a 10 footer Bass Raider 10E. It's already pre-wired for electrical. You can carry two motors. You see this is my rig. This is a 2021. The one that I have right now is brand new. It comes with a motor, battery, cams, tackle box, two signature series rod and reels. Um, it comes with uh, a nine foot. You get three kits, 240 pieces, hooks and lures. Okay, it's brand new, never been in the water before. Plus, you get the paddle, you get the seats, you get everything that you see here shipped right directly to your door. Okay, so if you think that you may be in the market for a boat, guys, I got it. And as the weather gets warm, these bad boys are going to become extremely rare. Okay, I've been fishing on this boat now for seven years. I've had these. The time I get them, people always buy them from Cam. I want your boat, I want yours. So if you think you're in the market, as soon as you go to camscrappyhole.com, you'll see it. When you stroll down, you'll see that Bass Raider 10E. It's already pre-wired. It comes with every bit of the manufacturer's warranty, including the battery. You get brand new battery, brand new motor. Everything's in the box. Plus, you get two of my best rod and reel signature series. Like I said, you get the nine-foot yank stick. You get the seats. You get the paddle. You get everything that you see here. Okay? The only difference is it's brand new with a brand new pinstripe, brand new paint job. 2022. A good view of where we're going to be fishing and where you should be fishing this time of the year okay you see if you look over here with your eye you don't see anything that is that stands out to you okay that may hold fish okay I get that all right obviously you can see I can't walk the bank okay because I'd be in somebody's backyard but you remember what I told you about prejudging where you throw that jig okay don't do that you your job right now you're not a fisherman you're you are counter surveillance Okay, your job is to, is to get out there and your job is to locate where these crappie are. Once you locate them, then you can kind of dial in on them, okay? That's why I got three different rods on the boat right now. And I'll show them to you a little bit later. I'm going to go into detail. But if you're still one of those guys out there, a grown man or a grown woman that's still carrying one pole and you got six, seven different baits and you, every time you want to try a different bait, you got to cut and retie, dude, that's downtime. Get yourself three or four or five different poles and you tie a plastic jig on each one of them differently. So all you have to do is put down one pole and pick up the other. Okay, again, you see those rocks, you can see the landscape, they just did that. And I don't see anything spectacular. If I came over here, I'd probably fish those rocks, but I know those rocks don't go into the water. They stop right there at the shoreline. I still don't see anything different. But because I grew up on this lake, I'm fishing the, the second largest private lake in the state of Georgia. Um, I know this lake, I grew up with this lake. Okay, I was fishing this lake when, when they dug it out. I'm going to go into more detail when I get up there, guys, when I do the cutaway. But right now, we're going to start with the Silver Stallion. Okay, and I got that black and chartreuse on there. Let's see if we can have some luck. So, thanks again for joining me. Have a seat. Get yourself something to drink. Pull your socks all the way up. And just sit down and, and get comfortable and watch me for the next 15, 18 minutes. The reason why some of my videos are so long, guys, is because I'm teaching. I'm showing just like you signing up for college you don't go in there for for 10 minutes and you're gone when you're showing instructions and when you're illustrating when you're putting things together it takes a little bit of time so if you don't mind guys bear with me because i'm trying to teach you how to fish what is that old saying you give a person a fish you you feed them for the day but if you teach them how to fish you feed you feed them for life all right so let's see if we can have a little bit of luck let's pull up we got some wind so i got to contend with the wind at the same time Let me say this to you the reason why you don't want to get too close because i know that we're early i know for a fact unequivocally that we're early okay so that means that the females which is the larger of the species when we fish for crappie my reverse is slow the females is the larger of the species okay now remember you see how when i land i know i'm throwing in shallow water so my rod tip is up at 12 o'clock. Look at the wrist. That's that silver stallion. Yank! There we go. Let me tighten that drag down. There we go. There we go. There we go. This is that silver stallion. Listen, when y'all compare my poles to anybody else, my poles to anybody else's poles, buying a pure carbon fiber. Don't compare my pole. Don't compare my pole to a, to a graphite. Don't do that. You're not comparing apples to apples. Look at this. 
Let me turn you guys around. Let me pull out a little bit, okay? Because I don't want to disturb the fish. Now I got my net on board. Let me turn you around a little bit. I got my net on board, okay? Let me pull out so I won't disturb the fish. Because I know I may land in, I may come into a big one, okay? Let me get myself together. And the reason why I film you guys from the back side of my shoulder, so I can show you guys scale. It's kind of hard for me, this fish is, is cold. Let me turn you around so I got you guys right here at me, okay? This fish is cold. Let me turn around all the way. There we go. So that means she's still coming up, okay? Look at that. And that's that black and chartreuse with that hologram flake. Let me show it to you. I'm gonna release her. I'm not gonna keep her. Matter of fact, I'm gonna let you guys watch as I release her, okay? Listen, I'm running that 116th. I'm gonna go into detail a little bit more. I'm running that 116th black and chartreuse with that hologram flake. I'm gonna put it up there real close so you guys can see it, okay? You choose what's, what color hook you want, okay? As a matter of fact, look, let me show you this. Let me show it to you. Now, if you catch out here catching crappie, if, if you're not tired yet of losing your crappie, this is what we all grew up off of. You see that little nub coming out of there? You see that little hook? Okay, I'm not going to trust that. I've done everything right. I, I, I got my electronics. I got my rods. I got my line on, spooled in correctly. I found the fish. And listen, I fumbled the ball right here at the 99-yard line by using this little old, this old school hook. Okay, this is not my hook and it's not my plastic. But I wanted to show that to you guys. Let me show you the nasty bend again. Guys, I, I just want you to look with your own eyes. Look at that. You see that? That's why my, 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 my hooks are so deadly. That's why we call them the nasty bend hook. Okay? They're chemically sharpened. Okay? I'm catching a lot of slack by sending these through the mail to the Postal Service. All right? Let's straighten them back up. That's that black and chartreuse with the hologram flake. All you have to do is go to camscrappyhole.com. And I'm going to show you a little bit later on when we do our cutaway exactly what um, my hardware and what I'm using okay but right now let's get back up there let's see if we can have some more luck you remember I told you we were going to target that tree didn't I a silver stallion I had to tighten my drag down a little bit early you have to remember that you're early you remember we're in shallow water so you keep that tip up yank there we go there we go. Oh, let's see if he's going to come back and get it. Let's see if he's going to come back and get it. Let's see if he's going to come back and get it. Got a taste of that hook. He didn't come back and get it. Ah, I was trying to work the motor because of the wind. He didn't come back and get it. Slow that jig down. Slow that jig down. Slow that jig down. Yank! He came back and got it. Slow that jig down. You see what I'm talking about? Let me turn you so you can see the fight. Let me turn you so you can see the fight. Look at that. Guys, you have to have an ultralight because that ultralight allows you to feel everything that's going on. Everything that's going on. You can hear my drag, right? You can hear that drag. Look at this. Man, this is a nice crappie. Look at that. Look at the tip of that pole. That's why you want an ultralight. Come back over here, big girl. Come back over here. Come back over here. That's that black and chartreuse with that hologram flake. Come here. Oh, there we go. God almighty. Let me turn you around. Let me say this too. I got to kind of lower my voice because we're still in the AM, okay? Let me back up. Matter of fact, I'm going to show you guys that hook set right where it is. Look at that hook set. You see that? Look at that hook set. Look at that. That's that nasty pin hook. And that's that black and chartreuse with that hologram flake in it. Look at that. That's a 12 inch crop. Let me, let me back up so you guys can see it real good. Let me back out a little bit too. Let me back out because I don't want to disturb them. And remember, we're early. We're early. Let's back out. Give me a little bit of slack. And let, me, let me say this to you. I want you guys to understand this. We know that we're early. Water temperature is just starting to come up to speed, okay? The ultimate temperature that you're looking for, let me turn this out a little bit. 
is between 56 and 62 degrees. When your water temperature hits that, remember the crop you're going to be in the shallows. Look at that. Guys, he's not going nowhere. Here we go. That's a black crappie. The reason why they call them in Florida specks, you can see the specks on them. If this was a white crappie, it'd have bars going down the side. Okay? This is a black crappie. White crappie grow faster than black crappie do. But the preferred crappie between the white and the black is the black. Watch me release this rascal. We're not keeping. Matter of fact, guys, we're going to be releasing about 98% of the crappie that we catch this year. I'm not keeping any. Okay, unless if I get a special order, somebody says, Cam, that lives right next door to me, some of my neighbors. Let me check my tie, make sure nothing's slipping. Here we go. Black and chartreuse with that hologram flake. And on board with me, I got that monkey milk and chartreuse in a curly tail, and I also have that red, black, and chartreuse in a curly tail, okay? And I'm running that silver stallion. I'm going to do a cutaway again. I'm going to show you all my hardware and my total outfit so you'll know just to go to camscrappyhole.com. And also, I want to show you the second store. How you, When you're in one store, you'll see a banner, a red banner across the top, across the bottom. All you have to do is click on it, and you can port between each stores. Okay, so if you just need a rod, or you just need a reel, or you just need a kit, our largest selection of our kits are in camscrappycombos.com. I'll go into more detail with that a little bit later in the show. Let's get back up there again. Some of you guys may be in the market for a tackle box, a backpack tackle box. I'm going to show this to you a little bit later in this cutaway. But I want to show you both of our websites so you guys can see. Okay, this is camscrappyhole.com. You guys can see that. You see that red banner right there at the bottom? You can port between our two stores just by clicking that. That's a hyperlink. So if you go to Cam's Crappy Combos, Com, you'll see a red banner at the top of the bottom if you're on a mobile device if you're on a desktop or tablet it'll be at the bottom of either top and all you got to do is click it it allow you to port back and forth between our two stores so you won't have to remember cams crappy hole.com or cams crappy combos.com so if you just wanted a pole or a reel or a crazy selection of kits all you got to do let me go back there we go all you got to do is go to cams crappy combos Okay, I don't know if you guys would be able to see that or not. Okay, so when you stroll down like this, you'll still see that, that red banner right there. Okay, so if you're on a mobile device, you see those three lines right there? They're called burgers. Okay, when you click that burger, you see a drop down drawer will open up. You see that? Can you guys see that? And when that drop down drawer opens up, you click the plus emblem to what you want, and another drop down drawer will open up. Okay, so let's say if you wanted to go to. Um, Let's say plastics and hooks. You click plastics and hooks and everything will come up. We got over 900 products in our store in camscrappyhole.com. Okay? So you got to know how to navigate around just to get where you're going. All right? And you remember I told you guys about that banner. That banner stays there. That red banner right down there at the bottom. That stays there. So that allows you guys. And listen, we got free shipping on $35 or more. Okay? Anything that you get in the store. So I wanted to show you that real quick because the front office told me about that. Um, you guys saw me walking up. If you think for a minute that you may be in the market for a backpack tackle box, this is what you're interested in. This is what you need. Okay? You got a large, look at this. I keep needle nose pliers. How many times do you guys need your, your, your needle nose pliers and you can't locate them? Hey, look, I can put two sets right here. Okay? We got a large compartment all the way up here at the top. I keep everything in here extra pair of shades, my light, plastics. I keep everything in here okay that's huge you can put a 12 pack of coke you can put a gallon of milk in here okay and you still got room you got fast compartments here on both sides guys plus you got zippers right down here at the bottom you got duplicates right here plus on top of that look at this look at all these trays look at all those trays right there okay I designed this I designed I designed this backpack tackle box and I made it you know why because I'm a crappy fisherman Okay, and crappie fishermen know what crappie fishermen need. Okay, when I tell you it's a backpack tackle box, look at that. Okay, so it's breathable, it's padded, and plus you got cleats on the bottom. So no matter what you put in there, it's designed to stand straight up. Okay, let me show you, let me give that to you guys. So, let me tell you what we were doing today. Let me turn around. <clears throat> um, 
we had a good day on the water. I want to make sure I can turn you guys up so you can see me a little bit. Let me see so you can see me. Uh, we had a real good day on the water. Um, my, my eyes, the allergies, everything's starting to bloom. So you guys kind of have to bear with me a little bit, okay? Um, the crappie were funny. We know we're at the top of the morning. I mean, I'm sorry, at the top of the year for pre-spawn. So I'm still early. And I know for a fact, let me pull you guys up a little bit so you can see me. I know for a fact that we're early. So when you get out there, they may be funny. You may catch three or four here. You may catch two here. Don't worry about it. Have different spots. Wait until that water starts warming up a little bit. Do not leave your lake and go for two, three, four weeks and come back. It needs to be every day or every other day that you fish that spot because they're coming. Just as sure as 40 runs north, just as sure as Peachtree goes to Buckhead, they're coming. Can you guys see me okay? I want to adjust it to make sure. Let's see. Yeah, I think you can see me real good. Okay, matter of fact, look, I got company coming up there to see me. Look, look, can you guys see the male and the female? Look at them, they're coming up here to see me. Look at them. <laughs> I'm on their territory. I'm not supposed to be here. Okay, so this is that time of the year. And if you notice, they're paired off too. Did you guys see that? So there's going to be a lot of fighting going on. I don't feel like getting beat up, so I'm going to make this real fast by those rascals because they will fight you. Um, let me show you what I was using first. I started off with the, sil with, the, um, with the Silver Stallion. Okay? We have two versions of the... Actually, we have three versions of the Silver Stallion. You can get it in a 6-foot, six 6'2", six and a 6'6". Six six. Okay? Let me see if I can show it to you real good. Okay, this is one of my favorite rods. You guys saw me starting out leading with this. This is that soft to the touch, uh, Fuji reel seed, EVA split, split grip, so it's easy and it's accurate. I designed this reel to, so you can really hold it in your hand for comfort. Okay, all of my rod and reels are just like that. Okay, they're counterbalanced, so at the end of the day, when you're fishing with them, you won't have a problem. They won't wear you out. All of my rod and reels, you guys have seen me do this all the time. Okay, they're counterbalanced. Hook holder, you see a detail? Uh, seven pound drag you, you guys probably heard my drag system on there also I have it in a signature series which is my top of the line this one right here I was running was a six foot with a seven uh, seven ball bearing uh, reel okay so it's a surefire bail and listen if you're left or right-handed don't worry about it it's, it's interchangeable you can take this handle off put it on the other side you can take this off and put it on the other side so whichever one that you fish with it's easy don't even worry about it at all okay so that was the silver stallion and what i was running on the silver stallion when i first started out which was the black and chartreuse which is notorious for catching crappie right guys you've known going through the years about black and chartreuse but what we did was we added hologram flake in there Let's see if you can see that flake that's that black and chartreuse and look at that hook look at that nasty bend hook Okay, and my tail makes it when it's, it's, a, it's a motion plastic. So when that tail is going through the water, it puts off a very, very, very faint, low frequency sound. And crappie can feel that, okay, including bass, but we don't want bass to hear that, okay? So this is what I started off with um, at the top of, 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 of this segment, that black and chartreuse with that hologram flake. You can only get this at Cam's Crappie Hole, and I'm pretty sure you'll see it right down there at the bottom, camscrappiehole.com. And what I was telling you guys towards the end of the uh, if you if I've, got, I've gotten to it, I don't know if I did or did not. Can't remember. But anyway, you see how how much that that nasty bend hook protrudes out of that plastic, guys. If you're catching 13, 14 inch crappie, this ain't gonna, this this that, the other hooks ain't gonna do you no good. You gotta have that nasty bend hook. Okay. It doesn't matter to me whether I use a gold, whether I use a bronze hook, a black nickel, or whether I use red. It doesn't matter. Sometimes I just reach in my tackle box and I just grab whatever's in there. Okay. So that hook holder. The reason why I designed that hook holder, watch this. And I want to make sure that you guys know exactly what that hook holder is. Look. You take that, that hook so you won't get stuck with it, and you clip it right here. Bingo. That's what the hook holder is for. Okay? So I started off with that silver stallion. All right? So I, I noticed I was throwing four, five, six times, and I wasn't getting any luck. That's why I switched. What I did, guys, I turned around. And I grabbed the white ghost. This is my signature series. 
This is the top. This is the very best that I make. 11 ball bearing reel. As a matter of fact, you can even pause the video right now and go get your reel and see how many ball bearings that you have in your reel. Some of you guys got three. Some of you guys got two. Some of you guys got four. Guys, on my signature series, I got 11. 10 plus one. And what is the one for? That one is so your reel will stop it from going back and forth. That's what that one ball bearing. You'll hear me say a lot of times six plus one. You'll hear me say, um, you know, eight plus one. You'll hear me say um, uh, five plus one. That's because that one ball bearing is what it does. It stops your reel. These are custom reels. These are my reels. These are cams. As a matter of fact, look, <laughs> you can see it right there on there. These are my reels. These are my rods. Nobody else on YouTube, guys, is doing what I'm doing. We have 109 rod, re rod and reel combos, crappy rod and reel on the market right now. I want to make sure you guys can see me real good okay i switched it up sometimes guys if that sun comes up it can make those crappy act different so when you're out there fishing it's cloudy when you start but then the sun starts breaking through that can create a that can cause the crappy to do something a little bit different so what i did was i turned around and i threw the red black and chartreuse okay with that hologram flake in it Okay, and I grab the middle head. I'll use a middle head, I'll use a round head, like on that one's a round head, this one's a middle head. Then I had that red hook on there. Okay, that red, just that little extra flare from that red caused them to hit. And the crappie are just starting to turn black. So I know that I'm early. So when you go out there and you catch three or four, five, six, remember that you're early. We're still in February here in hashtag Thump City, Georgia, okay? So that's why you'll see me a lot of times whenever you go into the stores, you'll see crappy jigs, you'll see a lot of different colors. The reason why you see a lot of different colors, because crappy want a particular color, a particular day. Cloudy, sun shining, water's murky, water's partially clear, water's crystal clear, water's windy. It, it all depends on what you're looking for. That's why that old saying, it's always better to have and not need than to need and not have. Okay, that's why it's very important. So if you don't know by now, you guys heard me say, listen, if you, 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 everybody out there, we're grown adults. Don't just have one rod. Okay, and you want to change colors and you do this and you tie and put on another hook, put on, put on another color. Don't do that. Okay, by the time you get finished doing that, I already caught three fish. You take two or three, four rods and you lace them up and you put different colors on. So you saw me when I put one down I grab another, pick it up, boom, I'm gone. Okay, so if you want the silver stallion, you want the white ghost, you go ahead and get both of them. And by the way, I'm the only cat that manufactures these rod and reels, the plastics, the hooks, the, the, the apparel. And along with that, I assist you in helping you own it. My finance company. So it doesn't take a, so it doesn't take a big bite out of your wallet. I know you guys have families to feed, okay? That's why I make it very, very easy for you to obtain my items. I don't care what other YouTube you go to. Nobody else out there is manufacturing, designing them as many crappie rod and reels, many hooks, many plastics, and they have their own finance company on two stores to help you obtain it. One in one store is called Afterpay. The other store is called Shop Pay. So how does it work? Okay, Cam, show me how it works, Cam. Let's say you want this rod and reel for $100. I'll break this rod and reel up in the four easy payments bi-weekly. $25 one week, two weeks, $25 another week, $25, $25, and you're finished. That's it. And besides that, it's no interest. No interest whatsoever. After you get finished paying your four payments, all you pay is $100. Let me, let me, I think that may have gone over some of you guys here, so let me repeat it again. No interest. Once you get finished paying $100, your four payments of $25, all you pay is $100. That's it. Okay? And also, I want to add to you guys, so if you need everything, make sure you go in there and you get everything you need. So you can't decide which color plastics you want. Well, listen, go ahead and get a kit. Get a kit with everything in it. Okay? So we got the nasty bin hooks. We got the chartreuse color. We got the uh, hot pink. We got the non-painted, non-painted. And plus, you get four of my most popular colors. All this comes in a kit. All this comes in the kit. So what you do is you take your time, sit down, go to my store, kick your feet up, get yourself some, some cold to drink, get you some lemonade, relax, and just browse through the store, okay? And once you make a purchase, once you make a major purchase, guys, I'm gonna send you this free. You get a trifold catalog. This is one of my catalogs here. 
so you can sit back in the comforts of your own home you can take a look at what we got okay and you're going to get a 20 page catalog which shows all of our items in here you get this free with a major purchase look i even got a look i even got a, a table of content in high school you guys didn't know what that was in college did you i got a table of content so you can find really what you're looking for real fast and easy okay you get this free with any major purchase now before I get ready to close, we get back to fishing. I want to show this to you guys so you'll know. You remember I told you about that nasty bin hook, right? This is not my hook. You can see I'm catching out there 12, 13 inch crappie. Look at this. You see that? That's old school. This is what you and I grew up off of. Okay? Technology has changed. Cameras have changed. Um, car, automobiles have changed. Um, clothing, attire has changed. Guys, you got to bring your game forward. Fishing has changed too. Don't use this little danky hook. If this is the only difference between you landing that 14, 15 inch crop at this little point right there, that's not what you're interested in. This is what you need. You got to have that nasty bend hook. Look at that. Once that bad boy goes in the jaw, it's not coming out. Listen, let's get back to fishing. This is my boy Cam. Come on, man. Y'all know me. Stop packing brand new. Let's get back on the water and let's yank some more crappie, all right? I know it's shallow up there, so therefore look at my tip of my rod. You see how it's up at 11, 12 o'clock? And the further I get towards my boat, I know it drops off to six, seven, eight feet, I lower my rod tip. Because when it first hits the, the water, I know it's only about 18 inches up there. So therefore I want my, my jig to stay up top. There we go. There we go. Let me tighten that drag down a little bit. That's what I'm talking about. I just told you guys. I just said that. Just said about that rod tip. Just said it. Guys, all it takes when you're crappy fishing is persistent. Just get a little bit of persistence. Let me turn you guys down so you can see this fight. Let me turn you down. It's that red, black, and chartreuse. Guys, and listen, I just put that silver stallion down and I was running the black and chartreuse. And that's why it takes a lot of Whenever you go crappie fishing, you have to have different colors. This is a male, too. Let me lift this bad boy in here. That's what I'm talking about. Listen, it pull you guys up so you can see this. Let me pull it up. <clears throat> Listen, I want to say this. Let me turn around full so you guys can see me. Let me get some slack. If I can do this, if guys, if I can get out here and do this in class, sun is starting to come up, in class, I was always the last one to have my homework, okay? And you know I made up every excuse that I could not to have my homework. Let me pull it down. Look at that. Guys, they're starting to turn black. That's that red, black, and chartreuse. That's why you go into the store and you will see a lot of different colors when it comes to crappie fishing, okay? Because one minute you could throw one color one minute, one color next. And let me go back to what I was telling you guys. That's that nasty bent hook. Let me, get, let me get this bad boy out of here. Look at that. That's that nasty bent hook. Red, black, and chartreuse. Do not leave the boat. I want you guys to see me release her or him. Okay? Let me show it to you. While I'm here, when you're fishing for crappie, and I guarantee you, <clears throat> you go out there, and because you did everything right, you get all the way down to the hook and you, you choose the wrong hook and the wrong plastic. You see this? This is not mine. Okay? Look at that. Look how that, that little hook. You see that gap? You talk, That was a 12 and a half inch crappie. Okay? And this little gap here is the only thing from, land, from landing that crappie in the boat. This isn't what you want. This is not my plastic. This is not my hook. Okay? This is my hook. This is my hook and this is my plastic. You see that? Look at that nasty bend hook. Even if he just barely even taps it. Guys, barely taps it. He's in the boat or he's on land. And listen, when you get tired of catching crappie and they right up at the boat or right up at the bank and they jump off, come see your boy Cam. Guys, I've been doing this for seven years now. We are 15 and a half million total views on all of our platforms around the world. There ain't nobody else on YouTube that you see that is a manufacturer, a designer, and gets out here and releases videos for you guys every two weeks and you guys can reach me there ain't nobody else on youtube does that 
guys, we're one of the largest, if not the largest, ultralight dealers in the country. We got 109 different rod and reels on the market right now, including the Silver Stallion. Okay? Plus, we got the apparel to match. Okay? This is designed specifically for crappie. That's what I make it for. Soft to the touch EVA grip. I don't want to go through it all right now. When I did the cutaway or when I do the cutaway, you guys will be able to see my equipment, my outfit. You heard me say just a little while ago, if you were starting a new job and that job said that you needed, um, you got to get um, you got to get yourself some steel toe boots. You got to get yourself a hard hat. You got to get some safety goggles. You'll go right out and do it for a job. But for what you love to do, you need two or three rods. You won't buy it for yourself knowing that this is something that you enjoy doing. And another thing I want to mention to you guys, you heard me mention just a second ago about taking one rod. And when you want to put on another jig, you cut and tie, put on another one. Look, guys, I got different rods in here. Matter of fact, I got three of them. Okay, the Thunder Blue is right here to the back. You see the, the uh, Silver Stallion here, the White Ghost there. And listen, treat yourself. Don't cheat yourself. All right? Listen, this is your boy Cam. Uh, get out there. We're, we know we're at the top of pre-spawn down here at hashtag Thump City Georgia. And if you need anything, just go to camscrappyhole.com. Listen, if you if you got a nice reel that you love and you know it's the, your favorite reel and you just need a rod, go to Cam's Crappy Combos. There we sell each item separately. And I want to mention this to you while I got you guys here. When you go to camscrappyhole.com, you'll see a banner stretching across the top or the bottom. It's red, okay? You can port between my two stores just by clicking that, that red banner, okay? You don't have to go between each store and type it in. Just use the banner. You can port from one store to the other. Very, very easy to do. Listen, y'all know me. This is your boy Cam, and all he does, mama, mama tell him, what, what does Cam do? All Cam does is catch crappie. Keep those hooks wet. Keep those lines tight, and we'll see you on the next turn.